good morning everyone we are here at uh, 656 that's right and you say where are we where are we at what are we doing well today guys we are here hunting so this place is supposed to have ourselves some very very nice uh, turkeys and we also could potentially be hunting some deer here if we can't find no turkeys so basically we're here for a turkey, sh a turkey shoot and uh, hopefully some deer as well so we're gonna have to see what we can do now I'm gonna uh, run on over here to my box and we're gonna order us up a vehicle so let me see here I gotta back out of this back out of that and then actually I need to go there and then I need to go all the way down actually no yeah here we go get my nice green vehicle should have arrived and step back and we look the other way, and there it is. For some reason, my flashlight is on. Let me see here. Ah, there we go. Now I got it turned off. All right, so we know what the time is. Excuse me, I do not want to do that quite yet. Let's see, I'm going to get myself sprayed down here. Let's see, what else do we have in the phone? Got that, so up oh, there it is. There's the gun. And there's my whistle too. So you have a nice uh, scope on it here. So let's see, I should be able. Right, I want my gun back. Hold on. So let's see. Uh, we got a nice watchtower up there and stuff. So well, let's go ahead and start driving. Well, actually, first I need to check my map here. So let's see. Here's the areas. That we need to look at. So we got some uh, the red areas around there. Those are high high scare areas. So a lot of the animals have been scared off, and so we're gonna want to drive uh, this way and hopefully get into an area where the animals are not uh, currently scared by hunters. So let's do that. Get this thing started here. There we go. So hopefully you guys can hear me above uh, this thing. I wish they put a road here. There had been a road, then the grass grew up and everything, so just drive on over to this one. Here we go. Get on the main, main drive here. There we go. Now we have to keep eyes eyeballs peeled because sometimes there are some animals next to the road, folks. Who knows why? Don't really know, but sometimes there are. Glad it's morning time. It's kind of nice to be able to see everything. Sun's coming up. Looks nice and good and everything. Also, the game warden did tell me they've been having some issues with feral cats, and so uh, the feral cats they're putting the uh, hurting on the turkey and duck uh, population. So we do have a list of cats that if we should stumble upon them uh, we are to help the park here and remove those pesky evasive creatures and you say well that's terrible why should you be killing cats how dare you well it's actually very important for conservation people because we have the cats that get uh, let, just let loose into the wild by all these people and so they start killing the wild fauna and fluoride Yes, there's a there's a joke as low. Wanna step off here? Ah, thumbs running. Let's see, here. I think I see an animal walking above the ground. That happens every once in a while. Not very, but it does happen. Well, we'll see what that is. But anyways, but yeah, so get the, the people releasing the cats and the evasive lizards and all those creatures and unfortunately most of the time we hunters that's what we're hunting we're hunting the dawn cats having to shoot them so they're not eating up all of the all the natural animals and stuff because that is a very severe issue that is what they do and it's very very unhelpful because it really does hurt the natural population hurts the food sources of bunch of the other animals as well and so the the trickle down effect of having wild cats can really affect the entire 
uh, local environment uh, quite severely. So that's uh, so that's why we have that on our list as well. So luckily we do have a list of turkeys. We have about I can bag about three turkeys, and I have permission to bag at least uh, two deer, depending on different stuff. So we'll have to see. So we're in the Bendon Forest. I think if I read my map correctly there. So we do have permission to do certain things. But yeah, definitely. Um, I don't have much of a lack for cats. Not sure if you read into that or not. But uh, definitely when it comes down to them eating the natural fauna and flora and turtles, especially as I'm a proud owner of turtles, I'm not a fan. It's not fun having to pick up your uh, dead turtles because cats been eating on them. It's not fun at all. So cats, they're not, they're not fun. They're not nice. They are very ugly little creatures. And there is a buffalo. Here, let me step off. We do not have permission to do hunt a buffalo, but there you go. Look at that buffalo right there running around. That is very cool. Love those things. Those things are very cool. We do have some here. We do have some down in Florida. And uh, hopefully I can see them at some point, but... Very cool. Very cool to see buffaloes out here in the wild. Kind of early in the morning for them, but uh, that's okay. Alright, so let me check my map here. That's that. Let's see. Okay, so there we are. We are going to that lake area. That's the best. Let's see. Where does that take us? That takes us to... Oh, here. We'll go down this way, actually. This takes us to a little lake. Hasn't been too much going on, so we will travel down here really quick. Keeping eyeballs out for any deer. Or well, hopefully turkeys. Turkeys may not be out this early, but usually they're running around in the sun. So, I mean, it's it's kind of tricky. You never quite know where those little gobblers are going to be running to. Alright, we got another base out here. going to take us farther that way, but let me go ahead and raise the flag here, so to speak. Also in some awards, we're doing that too, but now we have that base, so that's nice to have, and we got it cleaned and everything, so that's good. Anyways, moving on here. Luckily, with this thing going on, we don't really have to worry about uh, talking to that. But once I get off up here at the outpost uh, lookout, we're definitely going to have to uh, watch our speech a little bit. Nothing else, we gotta see a live buffalo. So that is definitely a huge, huge thing. Not too many people get to just come out and see a buffalo hanging around out here in the wild where they're supposed to be, so that's very nice. There's a turkey. Follow that turkey. I saw him flying through the air. I don't think of turkeys flying through the air, but I just saw one. Oh, and there's a uh, buffalo right ahead of us, and we've got to slow. I want that turkey for sure, but we got to keep a respectful distance of the buffaloes. Uh, that is a bit of an ordinance here, so. But I did see that turkey flying. That, that boy was big. That would make a very nice Thanksgiving dinner. Gotta make sure we don't disturb Mr. Buffalo here. These guys will attack you pretty good if you get too close. And I definitely don't want to have anything to do with Mr. Buffalo uh, up close. And there's our lookout tower. Hopefully.
hopefully that means I will be able to see uh, that turkey from up here. So we're going to drive on up. Oh, so got a go up here. Oh, very nice. Alright, turn that off. Well, we're going to walk on up here. We're going to see if we can spot anything with the sight. And hopefully, might be able to get a good shot off of here. Let's see. Alright, there's our road. Now we saw Mr. Turkey fluttering over here. And some tall trees there. That is a no no. Do not hit the buffaloes. I'm not sure why I'm here. Here we go. Get out of there. There we go. Alrighty. Alright, you can't really see a whole lot due to the trees, so back down we go. We're going to do some. Walk in here. I'm gonna check which which way the wind's blowing, and we will set off in the opposite direction because wind and scent that is the majority of what we do here. So let's see. It's going south. I'm gonna head off kind of this way, and we're gonna see how we do. So we're gonna go to slow walk. And we're going to get a little bit quiet here as we walk on down. Sneak through these here. And there's a turkey. That was a turkey. So the question is, where is Mr. Turkey? Mr. Turkey was like straight this way here. Now nah, we're heading right into him with the wind, but I, was, I heard a turkey. Up. Oh. After him. Alright. That's the thing with the turkeys is that they fly. When they do, they go fast. All right. So he just flew right back on this way. Straight on down here. So we keep hearing the turkeys. There's a crow. It's hard down here because you can't really see. Yeah, usually you can find the turkeys on the ground, it works out really good, but. This particular turkey's already in the air, so I think we heard that deer over here. We are gonna go find him if we can. So 
this deal over here. So let me see. Check my map again here. So I am on the other side. So we're gonna go towards that little body of water. And hopefully we can find some deer. Maybe some turkeys down there. Because I know I saw another turkey go that way. At least we actually saw a turkey. That's nice. But yeah, my reflexes aren't what they used to be when it comes to airborne creatures. They do pretty good if they're ground dwelling, but any other way doesn't quite work out. We're going to go ahead and slow the pace down here. That is a deer. Alright, so we heard him. We just heard him. That's the other thing I keep forgetting, I gotta check the tree line for those techies. chance though. Well, now that everything knows I'm here, might as well go check on that turkey. I totally missed it though. I totally missed it. But it was worth a try. That ran. Everything knows we're here now, so there's no sense in creeping through this anyways. At least we got a shot off at a turkey, that's good. Sometimes you can go through these and never find any, so... Good to see a turkey for once.
close to it, you are with him. Ah, oh, hello. There's some more buddies over there. Alrighty. Alright, well, we found the deer jackpot. Thing is, we've got to get to a good space and get them. So we gotta get through this opening here. Hopefully, our wind is behind us. Keep an eye on them. I want to get behind these trees. Some big bucks there. And this guy knows something's up. Alright, gotta get it nice and steady. Gotta aim right about there. Which one I hit now? Gotta get over there. No need to shoot another one when we already have one. Alrighty. What we gotta do is we gotta find the blood patch here. zone here. Go oh, ran off this way. Right, there's some more. And yeah, we'll be tracking them this way, so didn't hit anything, as far well as we can tell. Which that's not good. Right, now we got some bisons up ahead. Just making my day. Right, I have lost. There it is. I almost lost the trail. By the way, I'm doing a terrible job of tracking, that's for sure. Alright, we gotta go back up. Gotta find that last bullet trail. There you are, okay, so. Let's just be heading off in that direction. There it is. Now we found it. Still, still having some pretty good bleed coming out of it, so it's not major, but it's enough. Alright, where'd you go from here? Check these steps. Right here. Let's 
seem to be heading in this type of direction here. Now I've lost my trail again. Ah, there we go. He's running all over the place. Turkey again. I don't see him floating around. I don't see any signs of deer around here. Oh, this is. Ah, here we go. Where are we heading, deer? in this way. suspect that he's going to go on for miles so unfortunately I don't think we're going to catch up to him unfortunate but if we only gave him a flesh wound so that's not going to help us out well there went a deer let's see where am I at I am oh yeah I'm way way out well, alrighty guys, I'm going to go back to my vehicle because I've got, a, got stuff to do and I've got, unfortunately, not enough time to hunt this turkey for another hour. So, I'm going to head on back there and go, I'm going to call it quits. So, anyways, thanks for coming along with this little hunt. Luckily we did see some turkeys and heard a bunch of them, so that was fun. And we will guys see you guys here next time. Bye bye.